Alrighty, so we're just on our way to Caboolture for a carpet park in the shed. The family has a family of possums also that live in the shed, so they're a little bit concerned that the snake's going to take uh, one, two, or all of the possums. So it's going to go relocate the snake so the possums can live another day. He's been up here for a while because there's a snake poo up here as well. Oh, it's, really? It's old. <gasps> yeah. Have you got up? Yeah. So I don't usually like to head grab them, but when I'm up high, it's yeah. either going to be my head or his head. So. <gasps> wow. Yeah, I reckon he's made this spot home for quite some time because there's a lot of urate up here, which is like white chalky like substance. Yeah. And it comes out wet and then goes hard due to air and stuff and it yeah. gets quite hard. Right, I'm gonna try and get it out. <laughs> you never think about the uh, the other way. Yeah, the exit. Yes, your possums will live. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, there we are. So, carpet pies and kabulcha. Obviously, yeah, a lot of possums and stuff in the, the shed here. So, owner of the house wanted the possums saved and not eaten. Oh, well, I'm glad he was still up there. Yeah, me too. A lot of ways to get in and out there. Yeah. yeah. I wasn't expecting it to be right on the top, to be honest. But so how long do you reckon he, she was? Five, six foot? Yeah, Yeah, probably probably six, seven. I'm terrible with, with yeah. judging sizes. Yeah. They just coil and, and yeah. wrap and stuff. So you can never be pretty uh, spot on anyway. Hey, how are you? Imagine that personal space with these. No. <laughs> We got a border collie and she's much the same. Yeah. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> thank you. So You're thank a sweetheart. You he is. He's a lovely boy. All right, Miko, come on out. Miko. How is he with wildlife? Is he usually pretty good? Um, yeah, not too bad. They let us know when the possums are out. Yeah. Um, yeah, no, not too bad. 